All right, let's check the door. Oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God. Close it, close it back, close it back, close it back. Close, what is that? What is that? Close it back, close it back, close it back. Disclaimer, get ready with me. Realistic morning routine is a work of fiction. I forgot to turn off my back massager again. Sorry. <laughs> its contents is either the product of the developer's unhinged imagination or the use in a fictionist manner, excuse me, or are used in a fictionist manner. Any resemblance to real people living deceased or redacted and or events coincidental. Warnings. You read the warnings? Are we reading the warnings? Okay. Game features profanity, visual effects that may induce epilepsy, such as shaky text, visual glitches, and screen shakes and horror elements such as sudden tone shifts, unsettling audio, photorealistic images, discussion of existential dread, and anxieties about living under modern day capitalism. There's y'all warning right there. Don't don't say boy, you didn't warn me, okay? And you're probably going to get a short little snippet in the beginning of this. So don't say you didn't warn me. All right. The plan you have acknowledged that you have been warned and have agreed to take responsibility of your own media consumption. You acknowledge that withdrawal, excuse me, <coughs> uh, of consent can be done by closing the game program at any given time. Do you consent to this? I do consent. Oh, starting off with this jump scare already. I had the music too loud. Welcome to Get Red With Me, Realistic Morning Routine. Hi, if you're new here, I'm Boya. I play a variety of games, and if you enjoy anything that I play, it would mean the world to me if you subscribed. And give the video a like, a big, 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 big thumbs up, so I know that I'm doing good. <laughs> I'm going to turn the music down um, and get the settings all right and straight here because... Uh, I didn't get a chance to do that because I wanted you guys to read the, uh, what you call it, with me. Sorry, I'm trying to fix everything. Let me fix everything. Okay, I turned it down. It's still spiking a little bit, so if it is loud, I do apologize. I really do. But let's get started. Oh, look at her. Isn't she a cutie pie? Again, this is a horror game, so don't get too comfortable, okay? <laughs> Setting up the camera. Trisha. Good morning, everyone. It's your girl, Trish, and we're back at it today with another Get Ready With Me vlog. So, let's take a look at the things in Trisha's room. You see her fuzzy pillow and stuff? Yeah, we know what type of girl she is. Her little plushies and stuff. She's a little gamer. Okay. Probably only Stardew Valley, but there's nothing wrong with that. I like Stardew Valley. I just don't play it. In the gaming thing but if y'all want me to play it i'll upload a couple of things the same thing with minecraft if y'all want me to play minecraft i'll play minecraft but you guys gotta tell me in the comment section below uh let's go now today's actually a bit different from the other vlogs because i'm not getting ready to go to school or work today because i'm going on a date instead okay good for you trish i'm happy for you <laughs> you know the guy i talked about in last week's story time vlog uh oh anytime a girl does a story time vlog on you you either did really good on the date or, <laughs> or you did something like really bad on the date the one who got smacked in the face with <laughs> by my wig when it was super windy out yeah something really like bad happened to him i guess well I end up bumping into him again when I was buying my house plants, excuse me, and we got to chatting. And it turns out not only is he super cute, but he's super sweet as well. And he even goes to the same uni as me. Okay, well, at least y'all have something in common. I'm going to turn up the, the volume just a little bit so you guys can hear, you know, any jump scares or anything. He says he's in like medical school or something <laughs> and he's close to graduating which means that he's going to the <laughs> he's going to be super loaded soon so you guys go to the same university and um you just so happen to bump into each other that sounds like fate to me so help your girl get a bag and get ready with me okay okay i think that should be good for an intro chat I be doing the same thing. I be like, did that intro sound good? Now nah, let me redo that. 
Time to film some stock footage for the intro montage. It's really simple. Just some morning stretches and some nice overhead shots of my street. I wouldn't do that though. I think that's why I didn't really get like hip to the vlogging. I, when I started YouTube, I started vlogging type thing. But not like a drama thing, but it was like me, my brother, we were going to uh, the, sa the same university and we decided like, yeah, yeah, let's, uh, uh, let's vlog our, you know, whole situation, make skits and stuff like that. And then I just like, this isn't me. This doesn't sound like me. I don't feel right doing this. I already filmed the stretching bit, so I just got to get that window shot. Okay. Can we click on the set window? Can we click on other things too? Doesn't, okay, wait, wait. I did, I just clicked on the uh, laundry. I made sure to put away all my undergarments and stuff earlier though, so it doesn't get filmed. I might overshare sometimes, but that does not mean I want the internet to see what my underwear look like. I mean, right, H heck yeah. These must be her wigs. This is my wall of wigs. It started buying them after I started losing my hair. Oh, I'm sorry. At first, I was really sad when it started going bald. But then I realized I don't have to worry about shaving, bad haircuts, or <laughs> fry frying my hair with dyes anymore. I can just change my whole style on a whim. <laughs> it really makes me feel like a dress-up doll. Oh, why did you lose your hair? Do you have alopecia or cancer? I'm sorry. I mean, if you do, that's sad. What's this? This is where I keep all my beauty products. I've got a bunch of lipsticks, nail polish, concealer, primer, foundation, false eyelashes. Uh, funny haha. Voya does not wear makeup. It's not that I don't like makeup or whatever. It's just that when I first started wearing makeup when I was much younger, when I was 18, I used to break out a lot heavily and I couldn't understand it. And even when I got sensitive makeup for my face, my face would turn into a huge crunch bar. So I decided to take care of my regular skin just so I don't have to wear makeup anymore. And yes, I got a couple of, you know, dark spots from burns because I, I am a burn victim and my face did get burned. So I have a couple of dark spots from that. And, you know, just, you know, having acne that also discolors your face. But I think my skin looks great. But yeah, I don't wear makeup, but I love, I would love to learn how to do makeup just in case I ever wanted to wear makeup. I still can't believe I have people actually reaching out to me to sponsor their stuff. It feels so surreal. Let's hope I can keep the ball rolling on that. Oh, that's so sweet. You know, she turned a negative into a positive. She started doing makeup. She got wigs now. She feels beautiful again. Sometimes you just need that. These are my plushies. I got them all off at Betsy. Okay, at Etsy, we get it. Were they expensive? Yes. Were they worth it? Also, yes. Oh, is this going to talk about them? I put a link to the artist store page in the description. Remember to support small businesses when you can, guys. Okay, is it going to say the same thing? Yeah, it's going to say the same thing if you click on it. This is my PC where I edit my vlogs. I've had a really great time learning how to edit videos. Color grading and transitions are super fun to do. I have too. I'm still not good at uh, uh, editing, but I'm, I'm, I'm learning new things and it, it makes me happy. I still have a lot to learn though, especially compared to other vlogger videos. Oh, that's so sweet. Okay, I think we clicked on, oh, this, uh, not this bag, we didn't click on the bag. This is my purse. It's super cute, isn't it? I don't need it right now, but I'll be sure to grab it before I go on my date. Okay, I think that's everything that's, that looks important. Let's go ahead, click on the window. Okay, who are you? It's a cute guy outside. Yeah, I got some good filming done. Can't wait to edit it in. All right guys, so now that I've done my morning stretches, I'm gonna go and get some breakfast. So let's go to the kitchen. All right, let's see here. I want to do some chill filming of me preparing my coffee and eating some healthy overnight oats. Okay. After that, I get to film an advertisement for my new sponsor. Let's get to it. Okay, so that's kind of cute. What's this? These are my vitamins I got from a new sponsor. I'll advertise them after I've eaten and had my coffee. Okay. Uh, 
kind of almost highlights stuff that you can really click on. Okay, open the fridge. I opened the fridge. Hold on. Before we open the fridge. So for breakfast today, well, I, I mean, unfortunately, I already opened the fridge. So I guess we're just going to go ahead and go with it. So for breakfast today, I just had a nice bowl of overnight oats with a bit of strawberries, blueberries, and raspberries. It's super yummy and super easy to make. When you have enough money for produce, <laughs> so right, I cannot wait till I'm a big famous YouTuber, I promise you. I promise you, you guys are going to probably get some mini vlogs from me talking about how, oh my god, I'm eating so healthy and feeling better because being broke sucks. <laughs> it really does. Did, did we grab the oats? I just finished breakfast. I don't need anything else from the fridge. Okay, so... Th that was us finishing breakfast. What are these? These are all my mugs. My favorite one is the one with the kitty on it. Oh, so she likes this one right here. <laughs> ah, I want a cat so bad. I know my landlady doesn't have a problem with them. She doesn't even charge a pet fee. But I really shouldn't adopt it if I can't afford it. Vet fees. Yeah, vets are very expensive. That's why I don't have a pet right now. But again, big famous youtuber i'm getting a dog i promise you i am <sighs> maybe in the future oh you're so sweet i want a cat so bad okay yeah we already read that one dishes i haven't had a chance to do dishes yet i was thinking that maybe if i had time i can feel myself doing some chores later i made sure to rinse them a little so they're not too yucky even if it's in the background, if people see something weird or gross, they'll be sure to point it out. I swear, somebody pointed out that I had a sweater hanging in behind me and now it's like, I always catch it in the camera and that's kind of how my attention is. If you point out something in my background, I'm going to always and forever just look at it. I should be like, oh, dang it, they, they could see that. Let me move it so I can get it out of my way. As always, I just have to start the morning with a nice cup of coffee with a lot of French vanilla hazelnut chocolate creamer. It's a lot of flavors. I, I have to start the morning with coffee too, so don't feel bad. Is it good to have this much sugar in the morning? Well, it's as they say. I'm here for a good time, not a long time. Now that I've had my coffee and my brekkie, <laughs> that's, such, that's such a cute way to say breakfast. It's time for our sponsor, <laughs> Crusade Umbra Legends. Oh God, JK. <laughs> okay, that flashed away really fast. Today's vlog has been sponsored by, and then the knock at the door. Hmm, what was that? Okay, hmm. Uh, it's probably nothing. There's always weird noises going on in this old place. Anyway, as I was saying, Today's vlog has been sponsored by Fortuna Skill Multiple Super Guru Virants. Okay, vitamins. Excuse me, I said virants. Vitamins. <laughs> that is a mouthful. We're going to say the FPM Guru Vitamins. If you're looking for a multi-purpose vitamin to help you on your hair, skin, teeth, blood, and redacted contents, then this is the brand for you. All the essential vitamins you need are in one adorable little gummy. <laughs> if I'm being honest, I have no idea if these actually work. <laughs> At least she's honest about the product that she's promoting. Like, yeah, I don't use them, but, you know, it's a sponsor. So if you use them, try them out. Let me know if they work type of thing. That'd be the, yeah, that's what I would do. If I didn't use a product that I was promoting I would tell you guys that I'm not using this product that I'm promoting and that or that if I used it and I didn't like it I probably wouldn't promote it anyway but it, excuse me I had to burp but yeah I would uh, promote a product that I'm not using because how do you know if it works you could be promoting something uh, faulty and that's gonna all come back on you all I know is after flunking a semester of an expensive but degree that I don't even know is going to land me a job anymore <laughs> And living off of rice and beans for two months, I really needed the money. <laughs> wow. She's honest. Look, that would make me buy the product because she's honest. <laughs> or maybe just support her, not support the product, but support her. Um, 
because she's honest. Is it immoral to promote something I don't even know works? Sure. But it's not like I'm forcing anyone to actually buy them. And I literally said that most of my viewers skip the adverts anyway. Wait, did I say all that aloud? <laughs> I'm going to have to cut that out. <laughs> Me too, because I just burnt before this. Not too long ago, so. Anyway, now that that's out of the way, I'm going to head off to the shower and get started on my skincare routine and makeup. Let's go! Okay guys, it's time for me to shower. I'm going to do a bit of time skip so we can all meet back up again for my skincare routine. See you all in a bit. Uh, okay. So, I c can I click on the toilet? Just a regular old toilet, nothing fancy. Okay. Okay, so if you click on the toilet paper as well, it will just say, just regular old toilet. This is a painting I made for art class. I thought abstract was easy, but it turns out it's way harder than it looks. Not only do you have to choose cohesive palette, but you have to choose the lines and shapes carefully so it doesn't make the piece look off balance. It didn't turn out as good as some of my classmates, but I think I did pretty good for a first try. I mean, I guess, I guess. I uh, can't click on a toothbrush, can't click on the faucet, can't click on the uh, cabinets. I guess we'll go ahead and take a shower. Ah, uh, who's got their hand pressed against the mirror watching me? Don't be watching me. <laughs> All right, guys. Now that I'm all showered, exfoliated, and cleansed, I'm going to do some minor hygiene before getting started with my skincare routine. I'm just going to floss, brush my teeth, and clean out my ears. And now that that's all out the way, it's time to move on to skincare. My routine is super easy. It's usual, whoa. Uh, br brew art, what, huh? I couldn't see it. I'll see it in editing, but I couldn't see it. Okay. Now that I'm done with my skincare and makeup, it's time for me to choose my outfit and a wig for my date. I'm deciding what to wear. Are we going to ignore what just happened? Okay. If, if y'all going to ignore it, I'm going to ignore it too. But I settled on two outfits. Okay. This one. <gasps> that one or this one I like that one more today I think I'll go for oh, I get to choose yay uh, oh the pink is cute too I like the, the white shirt with the pink top it's very cute it's very adorable but my favorite color is blue and I think blue and pink mesh together so perfectly that I'm just gonna go with the blue Oh my god, I'm so glad I went with blue, 100%. She's so cute. Ah, I just love blue. And I hope he likes it too. Now that I'm all dressed up, I actually got another hour to kill before I have to leave. So I'm going to go ahead and do some chores around the house. All I've got to do is fold some laundry, dust my bookshelf, clean my toilet, and do some dishes. So, let's go and give the place some TLC. Let's go. Okay, let's fold our laundry. Everything's all folded and put away. Phew. I'm sure I do have a lot of clothes. Okay, uh, do we make the bed? Nope. Okay, we don't make the bed. Uh, okay, I guess we leave. Uh, let's go to the, not the bedrooms, lard, uh, the bathroom. Uh, and let's clean our toilet. Ugh. Well, at least the toilet's clean now. Though, I think I might need to fiddle around with it once I get back. I think there's something obstructing the pipes. You don't want to call a plumber? The tools that brought me should still be around here somewhere. I'm not gonna lie, I was my mom's boy, basically. Um, she, I'm a girly girl now, like super girly girly girl. Like, Stardew Valley, only play Sims girly girl. <laughs> like, 
But when I was younger, I was my mom's boy. I fixed the toilets. I fixed the laundry uh, baskets. I, I was her fixer, basically. Not just me, but, you know, my other siblings, my other older siblings as well. But, yeah, I hated it. So it's it's okay to fix your own stuff if you know how. But I haven't fixed the toilet in so long. I might mess it up. <laughs> okay. Toilet's clean. And... Uh, Oh, we can go to other places? Let's go to the foyer. Um, let's look at the plant. Nope. This plant? This is a snake plant I got from my soon-to-be boyfriend. <laughs> he said it's a good large house plant for beginners. He says they're good for air quality and hard to kill. I'll be sure to test that, all right? <laughs> okay. And the mirror? You should always do a fit check before leaving. Okay. And what's this? I don't need to go outside right now, laughing my butt off. Okay, and the living room. I don't think we went in the living room at all. What is that? What is that black book? Um, can't click on the keys. Okay. I'm just looking around just in case there's a chase scene or something. These are photos I have of my family and friends. Oh, such happy fond memories from a more carefree time. Oh, that made me smile and sad at the same time. Unburdened by the shackles of adulthood. And there's another flower. I can't click on this. Okay. I bought this vase while thrifting. It's empty right now. But sometimes I'd like to buy flowers too. Wait. Do you guys think my date will buy me flowers? Okay. And you can put them in there. Okay. Can't click on that. <laughs> The bookshelf all done and dusted. Maybe my date goes well. We can binge watch Sakura High School Death Club. Okay, together. I don't look. Don't make your, don't make your dates watch Oran Host Club. We know what we watch. We know we all seen it. <laughs> or Fruit Basket. Or, hmm, what's another one that we watch? I can't remember the other one, but it was like something Kiss. Don't make your dates watch that but if they do just know that if you make them watch it that means that they like you because there's not a guy I've ever met that um likes those shows at all or Sailor Moon don't make them watch Sailor Moon either <laughs> I've got all four seasons oh, okay that's cool what's this up here he did say he liked anime right okay so there's nothing in here let's go on into the kitchen and wash the dishes the dishes are all done. Man, what I wouldn't give for a dishwasher. Well, we can't have it all. Okay, tippity tap. Hmm? Who could that be? I told my date I would meet him at the park. Could that be one of the neighbors? I don't know if you guys heard that, but I just heard a knock. A very persistent knock. So I'm just going to go and see who and what that is. Usually when I hear a knock, it usually comes from the pipes my bedroom window or the front door I should check those okay uh, she said her bedroom window the pipes so let's go to the bathroom first and check the pipes I guess hmm no mystery sludge leaking from the pipes okay and her bedroom window let's check her bedroom window hmm I don't see anyone outside my window this time okay let's go to the foyer and check the door all right let's check the door oh god oh god oh god oh god oh god close it close it back close it back close it back close what is that what is that close it back close it back close it back it's not saying anything it's not saying anything it's not saying home i'm home it's me honey hmm? oh no no my phone scared me stop it look at this it's crawling in it's creeping in please let in oh god let me in see 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 no no guys so if you're new to my channel that was the apartment security guard <laughs> no it's not she's lying <laughs> she's 
she fly? Do you know how quickly I would hit the boots and get? Some people, somebody asked me, what does hit the boots and get me? It means get those feet. And I want you to hear this. Look, wait, you hear that? That's what your feet should be doing on the ground. Hit the boots and get run away. That's what it means. Run. I would be running. Usually they wander through the halls and take care of intruders, but sometimes they knock on the resident's door like you just saw just now. Part of my lease agreement is that I have to feed them if they do so. I'm going to go ahead and do that right now. See you guys in a bit. Okay, I think I have some leftovers in the fridge from last night. Ah, okay, let's go to the kitchen. Uh, I'm assuming it's this. Got the leftovers. I hope it <laughs> like spaghetti. And back to the foyer. We're here. I gotta be super careful handing over food. <laughs> Wish me luck, guys. Uh, feed? Uh -huh. <laughs> Another successful, successful, I can't even speak anymore. Successful feeding done. Now, I know that some of you guys said you couldn't imagine renting an apartment where you had to cook food for someone as part of your lease, but trust me, it's worth the price. I only have to pay, drum roll please, a hundred dollars a month for this place. Now hold on now. I might move in too. <laughs> I might move. So is is you just have to feed them? That's it? Okay, I mean, I, I could do that. And it comes with the unit washing machine. Can you believe that in this economy? I can hardly believe it myself. The landlady says she doesn't normally ask tenants to pay in money, but that she make an exception for me. Isn't she the greatest? So you bet your boots I'm not skimping out on meals for our lovely security guard. Hell, I'll even make them gourmet <laughs> if I have to. I'm not gonna lie, a hundred dollars a month for rent? I'd make him food too. I mean, I... I've fallen out of love with cooking food because of a lot of the trauma that I had to deal with in my past. So I'm tr slowly finding that love again. And uh, since I've been trying to find that love, it has been interesting. It's been fun. It has been wonderful in a way that I can barely uh, explain. So I'm just going to go ahead and be quiet and continue with the story. Can't afford rent anywhere else, especially when my boss keeps cutting my hours down to nothing like it's an Olympic sport. Hmm? Oh, it's almost time for my date, guys. I'm gonna get my purse real quick and head out. Then we'll end things here for today. Oh, I'm super nervous. Okay, let's go get our purse out the bedroom. Grab the purse. Got my purse. Huh? But where are my keys? Oh, I think I left them on the coffee table in the living room. I'll get those real quick before saying goodbye to everyone. I'm so scared to click on anything. Liver. Oh, grab the keys, grab the keys, grab the keys. Oh no. An interdimensional portal opened up in my living room. That hasn't happened before. Oh shoot, oh shoot. Uh, I really should be heading out. But Lanley said I can't leave these around or it'll swallow the whole building. Guys, I'm going to have to perform an emergency ritual to close this thing. Can you imagine you watching a YouTuber and this happens? Would you continue watching the YouTuber? I don't know if I could. Maybe I would. I probably would. I'm high key freaking my water bottle fell in my hand. Everything keeps jump scaring me. I think it's because I'm on edge already. So, uh, just bear with me. I'm high key freaking out because I've never done it before, but I've got these safety protocols saved on my phone. Okay, it says here that I need a ritual book, some candles, and purple teas, V rock icor. Okay, I'm assuming we gotta have to get that black book up there. I don't know what that is, but. It sounds like a soft drink. She's gonna die. She's gonna die messing with me. 
It should be around here, right? I remember the landlady gave me all the ritual items as a housewarming gift. Let's hustle, guys. I can't be late. My life depends on it. Let's grab this book right here. Oh, thank goodness. I've got the ritual book. Weird language, but oddly enough, I think I can pronounce the words. Good, because I can't. Do we still grab our keys? Okay, we can't grab our keys. Uh, No, no, not the living room. Let's go to the kitchen. I don't think we need the vitamins. Maybe something in here that we need. Okay, there we go. But why is it in the fridge? Oh, it doesn't matter. Good thing I didn't throw it away. Okay, let's go to the bedroom. Was there anything that stuck out? Candles, see right there. I got some candles. I hope the ritual's okay with easy sea breezy. <laughs> oh, thank goodness, guys. I got all the items. <clears throat> I sure hope this works. Wish me luck, you guys. I cannot read that. I invoke the will of the absurd let what the known become unknown <sighs> let what's known become unknown and what is remembered to be forgotten hidden one I beseech you I think that's what it says I shall something I shall something is it gonna show up here okay nope it's not gonna show up here thank god that's over oh there's my keys all right, you guys, it's time for me to head up. Thank you so much for keeping me company this morning. I'll see you guys in a few days with another vlog to tell you how it went. Bye, everyone. Love you all. Subscribe. She, If you can subscribe to her channel, you definitely need to be subscribing to my channel, okay? I just got scared for nothing, okay? I mean, kind of. There was kind of some jump scares. <sighs> okay, Trish, you can do this. I, I hope he likes me. Can we at least get a... Oh, he's... Ah! Ah! He's cute. I, I don't even need to see the face. That's all I need. Look, if I can get a... Head, if I had to date a headless guy, I hope he looks... His body looks as good as this. Good job, Trisha. Thanks for getting ready with me. Wish we saw his face, though, but I mean, it's okay. Well, there you guys have it. Get ready with me. A morning routine. A realistic morning routine. Uh, I don't know how many of y'all do this in y'all morning routine, but uh, I don't. So, yeah, if you do and you enjoyed the video, go ahead and smash and I mean smash it hard till you break it. That uh, like button, uh, subscribe, and comment what rituals you do in the morning. <laughs> yeah, and with all that being said, peace and love. And if you guys want to know my morning routine, it's uh, get up in the morning, drink a cup of coffee. Thank God for another beautiful day he's woken me up to. And... Say hello to you guys. Other than that, I don't think I have anything else. I may shower, brush my teeth, of course. You know, I don't feel like I need to mention that I do that because it should be obvious that most people do that in the morning. Not most people because, you know, sometimes you have your lazy day. But, you know, I do it in the morning. So peace and love. Stay safe out there, everybody. Make sure you do your rituals so the black hole doesn't suck up your apartment. Peace and love. Bye.